Good morning. This talk should resonate for, uh, I'm sorry, with a number of you. Uh, you're running on a basketball court or a tennis court and you feel a pop and hear the sound and you feel like you were shot and you turn around and look to see who just hit you. You just tore your Achilles tendon. Uh, that's the long, thick tendon in the back of the ankle and that's responsible for allowing us to get up on our toes. Uh, it can be a terrible sound and a terrible feeling and a lot of people are really distressed when they uh, when they hear that sound and feel that pop. The pain isn't particularly bad immediately. Uh, the pain will certainly set in later as the swelling uh, does as well. So what's next? You choose to either go to the emergency room or your friendly local physician or orthopedist and they perform an examination and confirm for you that you've torn your Achilles tendon. Is an MRI necessary? <clears throat> no, not in most circumstances. Do many physicians utilize it? Sure. Um, it helps confirm the diagnosis and it can also give us um, uh, some information which can be used in the treatment decisions. Now, I went online and I googled uh, Achilles tendon ruptures th uh, this morning. There's a lot of information uh, that shows up on the first page that is not entirely accurate or at least doesn't reflect uh, what's what the literature currently shows. So is surgery indicated or not? Uh, what happens if you don't have it fixed? Is it weaker? Uh, is there a risk of re-rupture or tearing it again? Um, what are the complication rates associated with surgery? The literature or the scientific research that's coming out has, over the last few years has clearly shown uh, that the non-operative treatment is just as good uh, as operative treatment in the vast majority of circumstances. Uh, the most recent paper I read this morning uh, had uh, 70 patients treated operatively and 70 patients treated non-operatively. Both groups did the same. Interestingly, the re-rupture rate was almost the same uh, in the two groups. However, the complication rate is much higher in the operative group. Why? Because it's surgical. You have the complications of surgery. You have the complications of having an incision on skin that is very thin and doesn't tolerate uh, infection or pressure very well at all. So what I see online is uh, new techniques. We do minimally invasive techniques. We use a smaller incision. We'll get you back on the court quicker. When there's not enough uh, mentioned about you know, the fact that we can put a cast on you and get you back almost just as rapidly as if you choose to have surgery. So if you are um, unfortunate enough to have recently suffered uh, an Achilles tendon rupture. There are treatment alternatives uh, available that are non-operative and there are op operative treatment of treatments available as well, which is best for you. Uh, that's between you and your surgeon because this is not medical advice. Something to think about. Have a good day.